Hi, my name is Kathy Patterson Sterling, and I'm the Director of Family Services for the Sunshine Coast Health Center with your question of the week. Lately, I've been receiving a lot of emails around the topic of boundaries. And so in this three-part question video, what I'm answering is the different aspects of what boundaries are. So this week, what I'd like to look at and examine is a question that I often receive from people where they say, Kathy, when do I know how to set a boundary? And I'm afraid that what I'm going to say is wrong. So remembering from last week that setting a boundary is about teaching people how to treat us. And that can be simply expressed in the phrase, this isn't working for me. And explaining to the person what is not okay and exactly what you need for that situation to change. It's about honestly communicating our feelings. What happens for so many of us is that we're afraid to actually talk about our feelings. We argue about whether we have the right to feel a certain way. So what's important with boundaries and how to set them is looking at what you're doing is communicating to the person what it is that you need. And you're doing that for yourself. And an important rule of thumb is if you're going to set a consequence with your boundary, because the person is constantly challenging your boundaries, then what you want to do is not gamble more than what you're prepared to lose. So don't throw out ultimatums like, I'm never going to talk to you again, or you can't live here, unless you're prepared to back them up. We don't have integrity in relationships if we say to a person, you can't live with me anymore, and we don't follow through. So be careful when you're communicating what it is that you need, if you're setting a consequence attached to that, that you're really clear that this is what you're saying. Try and live in the gray area of life, not the polar opposites of black or white, but try and live in the gray. And think about what it is that you want to communicate. You have time. You don't have to react in the moment. Thanks so much for your question of the week. Take care. Bye.